So hi and welcome to another Slashuary review and today I have Doom Asylum for you. So yes, get, let's get into technical stuff. Doom Asylum, 1988 from the US, directed by Richard Friedman, written by Richard Friedman, uh, Rick Marks and Stephen G. Menken. Starring Patty Mellon, uh, Ruth Collins, Christine Davies, William Hay and Harrison White among so, uh, this film, Doom Asylum, is about a very horribly disfigured man who was brought into the morgue uh, after a car accident and he was mistakenly pronounced dead. And he wasn't dead. So he <laughs> awoke, uh, came back to life and uh, started killing people. So now the asylum is, you know, being haunted by this disfigured man killing people and you know we have this group of kids uh, who, who drives by the asylum and you know just want to have a good time hang out you know yeah so I mean I've seen this film twice now and before watching it the first time like I have I hadn't even heard of it I think it was one year ago two years ago maybe that I saw it I had no idea what I was in for I mean what I like most about this film is that it's a film that doesn't take itself seriously. It knows that, that it's like hilariously a, a B movie and like it, it's just super wacky and it knows that it doesn't take itself seriously so that's why I like it so much. And it has a lot of hilarious moments. And it has Patty Mullen you know, from Frankenhooker and, and Christine Davis from Sex and the City. Yes, she's very young in this one. Uh, she plays a very, you know, weird character. Uh, and uh, yeah, I think also this film, like, it spoofs, like, ca characters from slasher films and situ situations from slasher films. It makes fun of them. And at least I, I hope. It, it does because uh, these scenes are hilarious like uh, in one scene uh, a person is sits on a chair while the horrible man uh, is coming forward with like a saw like a blade towards them but they're just sitting and like oh, I'm, oh, I'm gonna you know you can blah, blah, blah. and then ah she just uh, sits there uh, so I mean that has to be like some kind of spoof or parody or something uh for characters to just ah, don't run away or um, anything and also they uh, they have these ridiculous like what if slow motion scenes because two characters they they meet and then they like kind of like each other so in their minds uh, they're like running towards each other in slow motion and it's so you know romantic and hilariously done so that's why I like this film. It's very funny and uh, the deaths are quite creative. Wish they had been even gorier. And and then we have like a very ridiculous fight scene. It's so ridiculous. Like the choreography choreography is very very weird, but it's fun to watch. And you know uh, the characters are. They are they are fun to watch as well, and yeah, it's just a very hilarious and funny B film that doesn't take itself seriously. So that's why I like it. And um, I have my Arrow version of it. Yes, very cool. So yeah, uh, I do recommend you all to watch it, and I will give it a. seven and a half out of ten yeah seven and a half let's do that so have you seen it do you like it or not let me know or do you plan on watching it let me know but thank you for watching and as always have an amazing evening see you next time